Hey guys, welcome to Frank's Tech Help. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use the Mini DV MD80 as a webcam. I've had quite a few people um, contact me through my original review of this product asking how to use this as a webcam. Now on the Mac I have not successfully um, been able to get this to work as a webcam um, using various programs like Video Glide such as that. Um, but I have figured out how to get it to work with the PC and I've got it up and running with Skype right now and that's the example I'm going to show you. First thing is to make sure that you have your memory card inserted into the side of it. Now when you're facing the unit you're going to have your power button over here, your uh, record and stop button up on top, and then your voice activated recording button on this side. This is extremely simple so in the background you're going to see I have my computer up. I'm going to plug the unit in there give it a second to register as an extra drive my system there we go removable drive D if I go into there we see the DCIM folder 100 media I don't have anything on it right now very simple push the button that's normally the voice activated recording if you press that it's going to disconnect okay and uh, as you see the Windows the Explorer window went away but if you come over here to Skype and go into video settings you'll now see that it's active as a webcam so there we have it my ugly mug there and uh, <clears throat> very simple solution there like that so there you have it <clears throat> pretty quick now if you push it again it disconnects the camera and it'll go back in to um, should see a window pop up here to access the media as it usually does by default but anyway that's how you use the mini DV MD80 as a webcam once you plug it into the USB push this button let it disconnect go into the application that you want to use and it should be active as a webcam I um, hope this helped you guys out thanks for prodding me a little bit to finally find a solution sorry I didn't have time until now to get to this um, last thing I'll say is just make sure you have your media card in there whenever you're gonna do your files or the webcam because I couldn't get it to recognize without a card in so hope this video helped you out if it did please post a comment if not poke Mahone as usual thanks for watching Frank's Tech Help <laughs> Sit back as we go zoom, zoom, zoom. Who she is, what's the trouble?